Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com with another two box break, pick your team two, of 2022. Deuces are wild. Bowman Draft Baseball First Edition. And you gotta have at least two teams if you wanna be part of the promo where you can win a box of this Bowman Draft First Edition. We'll send that to you sealed, whoever the winner is. All card ship. Big thanks to this group right here for making it happen. Appreciate it. If you have a little rooftop next to your name, thanks for uh, helping us fill up that team random there. Appreciate that. Ryan Hines, Double Last Spot Mojo, Pirates and Mariners. And good luck, everybody. Appreciate everybody getting in. You know, Chad, I was telling the gang earlier, I was like, the Raiders have lost so many games in embarrassing fashion this year. It was uh, it's finally nice to be on the other side of that. Also, we, we are, we're, we're pretty much booked for the night with another one of these breaks and then another filler and then et cetera, et cetera. But Teddy Jaspi is live on Instagram. He's about to check out. So if you want to do a last minute personal box to them, be sure to, uh, be sure to hang out with him. Check in with him, hang out, maybe buy a box or two. Gilo, you don't think Bill Belichick's that harsh? Uh, yeah. yeah, maybe with a skill position player. I feel like I've seen him. I've seen like maybe like you know a second string linebacker who will make like a mistake, and that guy's gone the next day. Although I I, I think it depends on the circumstances. If Belichick was specifically like, hey, you're going down. Knees on the ground as soon as you, you know, blah, 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 blah. We're taking this to overtime. I, I don't know. What were his instructions? Has there been like a reaction video that's come out from uh, like, is there a Belichick reaction video? Have we seen that yet? Although someone was saying earlier, they're, they're, they're like, well, I don't think the Patriots have enough wide receiver depth to do that. Jonathan Mejia to 150. And that will be for the Cardinals. That's going to go to Mark. And we got a Judd Fabian, one out of 75 for the Orioles. That's for Chris, Chris Butler. Yeah, look for one. I want to see like, a shot of him just scowling, you know, as soon as that interception happened, or maybe, maybe like uh, throwing a throwing a helmet or a headset down on the ground, something like that. You should have seen how happy Teddy was when that play happened. Chad thinks, I don't think Bill knows what to do right now. Predict his release. He has rookies that need to be seen what they got. Season's almost over. Unless they think they can win out, right? 
There's Angel Martinez, 90 out of 150. For the Guardians, Simon with Cleveland. Tamar Johnson's one of the guys we're looking for as well. Pirates, that's going to be for Ryan Heinz. And Angel Martinez will be for Cleveland. That'll be once again for Simon. Jackson Holiday Parallels, that's one we're looking for, for sure. This goes to Chris Butler and the Orioles. Number one, first overall, first first. A lot of firsts here, Orioles, that'll be for Chris. Number all, card ship. Uh, Orioles are kind of building up that team a little bit. They looked pretty competitive last year, if not great at some points. 139 out of 150. There's uh, Pacciola for the Cubs. That'll be for Travis. I wonder if they some a few more of those young guys click. Maybe they throw some free agent money around. Definitely need some pitching. There's Jake Bennett to 75, but they've got some pitchers coming up the ranks too. You know, we'll see. Yeah, thanks, Chad. I feel like the, I feel like the Raiders have had their share of embarrassing losses. Elijah Green's another one of those guys we're looking at. He's with the Nationals, and that's going to be for Simon and the Nats. Found one on Twitter. Typical Bill press conference said it was a mistake and just left it at that. Bill, 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 is that a play that you called? It was just a mistake. Did you instruct your players to go down, or did you want them to extend the play? Listen, guys, it's just a mistake. What will any punishments be? Listen, it's just a mistake, guys. <laughs> just a mistake. You don't have to top on any Mac Jones going forward. <laughs> Numbered autos, you don't have to top on them. Was there discussions about extending the play? Uh, it was, it's just a mistake. Just a mistake. It's just a mistake. What's their next game? We're on Cincinnati. We're on Cincinnati. All right, second box, pick your team two. And then we'll run that randomizer to see who wins that box. It's just a mistake. Just a mistake. This guy's just a mistake. I definitely want to see. There, it's it's going to come out at some point. I'm going to see see a uh, if he had a reaction, but like his his on field reaction as that play was unfolding. Just a Belichick cam. I want that Belichick cam there. I did not know that. Apparently, Cody Bellinger's one-year deal with the uh, Cubs also includes a comeback player of the year bonus of a million dollars. I'm not sure what the odds are of Cody Bellinger 
winning that particular award. I don't think it's very there. I don't think the odds are very good though. Those guys will get all sorts of incentive laden stuff. Get it, get X amount of bats. You know, you'll get an, you know another five hundred thousand dollars. Make an all star team. Get five hundred thousand dollars. There's Sedan Rafella for Boston. Chris Butler. We've got a Dylan Lesko, 107 out of 150, blue parallel for the Friars. That's going to be for Ed P. And San Diego. It's Jonathan Class, 4 out of 75. Class A, maybe. Correct, Gilo. I don't think the... I don't think there's that weighted to your division schedule anymore. I'm pretty sure everybody's playing each other at least once, right? I suppose the number of games may vary. I don't know if it... Does it break down evenly? There's Chase uh, DeLotner, 44 out of 50 for Cleveland. That's going to go to Simon. But yeah, that unbalanced schedule should be gone starting next year. Ninety-four out of one hundred and fifty. Ryan Ritter for Colorado, which now got me thinking. I kind of forgot about that. That got me thinking. Oh, is the schedule already out? It might be Chad Dawes seeing Mariners Padres in July. Maybe it is already out. But I don't know if it's evened out home and away, right? If Mariners playing the Padres, whether it's home or away, there's no like corresponding fixture on the other side, right? Maybe it switches off the next year. So the interesting thing, what will what will that do with uh, with standings? You know, like there'll be you know maybe teams who are in bad divisions. You know, maybe won't be lucky enough to beat up on a bad team twenty times a year or something like that. However much it used to be. So I think the idea is to uh, to balance things out a little bit. All right, there you have it. Two boxes down. Thanks very much, everybody. Let's give away a box. You've got to buy at least two teams. Let's see who followed the instructions here. It's alphabetized by your first name. Chris Butler won two teams. Won three teams in this, but for the purpose of the promo, two counts, that's still an entry. CC got two, that's an entry. Ed got three. Two count for the promo, still an entry. Oh. Mark bought six, that's three entries. And I don't know, Mike P got one, that's an entry. Matt only, oh, Matt won one, Nick Koba won one. Ryan Heinz. Bot two, one two, two entries. Or no, another entry right here. Won a bunch of teams in this particular one. 
So Ryan actually had six teams, so that's three spots right there. And then Simon bought two, that's an entry, and Travis bought two, that's an entry. And go, let's spot check this a little bit. So we got Travis, we got Simon, we got all of Ryan's spots now. Not Nick, yes Michael, not Matt, yes on Mark, Ed, CC, Chris. All right. Good luck, gang. Let's see how this shakes out. Let's use the live dice. And it's going to be a four and a four, eight the hard way. Name on top gets the sealed box. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eighth and final time goes to Ed. Congrats to you, Ed. Sealed box going your way. I'm Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. Thanks for watching. Thanks for breaking with us. And I'll see you next time for the next one. Bye-bye.